I think almost like six months ago, we played the first episode. A A off. Vasank. Okay. Motherfuckers got a Gmail. Yeah, home alone. Norwood hitchhike. Let's see what we have here. I love hitchhiking. Are you guys ready? This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help even if just a little bit. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. <laughs> I'd go to every convention I get the chance to, and sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. This convention I was at went great, and it was now the day to drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over 12 hour drive. Okay, okay. Wazda to drive. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh, all right, just met my favorite streamer. Oh boy. I got his, oh, that's my friend. Oh, I wonder if he's going home. He met his favorite streamer too. What the fuck is this? What's going on here? Discord, we got ticks, so I'll see if I can get the car, let you know. Finally gonna take Milo on a walk. LOL. ALR LOL. Okay, the plan is on. Hell yes. Wait, you're getting the car. Yup. Big girl, you sure Ash can't come? I'll get the skateboard too. Saw this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Is something happening? Driving at night is really therapeutic for me. I'm just reading my texts in the middle of the road. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna like pull over to the side here. Fucking asshole. Space to get out? The fuck? Alright. Let me read my texts in the middle of the road. No one's coming. Could have left- Whoa, whoa, what's happening here? Sounds fun. Discord, where you are, almost there. I don't see you. Peach shirt, it was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Oh, okay. You sure driving all the way back? I don't really have a choice now, do I? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, dad. Oh, not sure if it'll be this lifetime though what do you mean stuck in the biggest traffic jam of the country that sucks it's not too good here either i think it's the people from the convention what the fuck oh my god there was a guy that's it i'm rerouting here you gotta do what you gotta do all right all right all right all right dad you called yeah i think i'm going to that convention could i get your car for like five days please with who Aiden, the internet friend, he's a nice guy. No, you're not going on a 10-hour drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand anything? Let's talk when I get home. Drive safe, Holly. Don't forget to call me. Oh, I guess something happened. You got it, Dad. Anything else? Leaving now. Oh, my God. Fucking internet friend. Jesus. All right. Fuck me. No, I don't get service in my car. My car's fucked. I have to get out of my car to read texts, all right? All right, so we're on this fucking road. Is it me or is the steering wheel, like, not oriented correctly? Shouldn't it be the opposite? <laughs> I don't know. All right, let's see here. Yeah, it doesn't look... All right. Motherfucker, there's no- we're using the phone. God damn it, I'm driving! Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city, got stuck in a jam. I'm driving, man, relax. All right. 
Okay. So I met my favorite streamer. I got to see Halo Infinite 3. Oh boy, I can't wait. They said they're gonna actually fix the game this year. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh my god. Near halfway through the drive, I realized I was low on gas. Fuck me, where am I gonna find a gas station, man? I'm in fucking buttfuck Missouri. Shit. I've been reading the fucking map quest backwards. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Told you to take that flight! Oh my god. Dad going off of it again. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's too late! Oh, Holly, it's gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling alright. Oh my fucking god. I'm not gonna respond. Chatty just cares, okay? Oh shit. Alright, we got a gas station here. Oh, okay. Okay, oh fuck. Oh shit. Alright, we're just gonna turn. Oh, oh, hold on. We're gonna just orient ourselves here. Oh, oh fuck. Is it on the left? Is the fucking gas on the left? Dude. Oh no, we're good. Owned. 50-50. Wait, where the fuck do you pour the gas in? It's one of those weird-ass cars. The fuck is this? There's no gas area. Whatever. The fuck is this? Norwood Gas Station Automotive Fuel. Uh, I'm gonna get a drink. Might as well. Okay. Oh, there's people in here. It's not that weird. What the fuck? Okay. Ayo, hey, five. Ma'am, hi, can I get $10 on pump two? This fucking guy. Bro, you work out? Dot, dot, dot. You heading to the bridge by yourself? Uh, huh? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful. What do you mean? For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. Oh, great. And people who went looking for them never returned. Oh, yay. Locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees. Cool. Can I use the toilet? It's not cleaned. Oh my fucking god, this fucking motherfucker. What are you even doing, bro? What are you even doing on your computer? Back the fuck up. Move the fucking king to the left, the goddamn ace to the right, you win. Dumbass. Dumbass. Where's your bathroom? Can I get any snacks? Who is this guy? He's been staring at the fucking milk for like a year. Uh... You heard about the Norwood Valley Monster? How's your night going? Huh? The Norwood Valley Monster, you know anything. Big mistake. Uh... Okay. Did I say something? Chat, what do you guys want? I'm feeling... Hmm... Oh! Oh my god, I can actually buy shit? Wait, I have money? What the fuck? I could actually buy something. Um... I'm thinking... I'm thinking we go with the chips... And a nice... A nice lime or whatever the fuck drink. Okay, fine. We'll go with a soda. Alright, I'll take one of those. There it is. Might as well. For the road, you know? For the, for the road. Wait, I don't want to drink it now. Increases your sprint speed? The fuck? Alright. Do they all do that? Nuts? Chocolate? Carrot drink? Alright, let's get chocolate. All of these increase your sprint speed. Okay. 
delicious. Oh, my belly's full. Feels good, man. All right. And one more thing. If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on gas as hard as you can. Why? Some people say that she died in a car accident there on prom night. Some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. Regardless, she's out for blood. Whatever you do, never ever under any circumstance pick up a hitchhiker. Those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think, ma'am. They just ain't. Uh, okay. Fuck me. Who the fuck is that? Who the fuck is that guy? What is mom saying? Holly, mom? I don't know if you'll find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get something for a mile? Hello? I'll pay you back. Fuck! I'm in five... I'm, I'm in a state five states away! I'm not even... I, I have a ten hour drive! All right, we're going. We're going. I think we're good. How's the gas? Why is the empty symbol still on? I definitely got gas, right? Do I actually have to, like, use the gas pump now? What the fuck? Uh, yeah, all I did... Pump number two? Oh, shit. Pump number two? Pump number two. Oh my god, I gotta reverse it. Alright, hold on, hold on. Reverse that shit. Okay, back it up, back it up. And done. Feels good, feels good. Alright, let's leave it right here. Okay. Motherfucker. I filled the tank and I was off to road again. Okay, we're good. We're good. Since my mom, I had to buy something for Milo from the store. Okay. They sell dog food here? All right, we gotta go back in. Do I trust the dog food here? Is that dog food right there? Pat Pat, new for good boys and girls. All right. Okay. Hey, yo. That'll be five dollars, ma'am. Okay. All good. All good. All right. I'll just put this in the trunk. And I'll put it in the passenger seat, right? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I could just put it in the trunk. Okay. Oh, yo. All my shit's in here. I could just put it in the trunk. I am trying to do that. It's refusing to put it down. I could just put it in the trunk. Bro. There you go. Done. Uh-oh. There it is. Fuck. Okay. Nope. Nope. There you go. Fuck. No. Shit. Yes. Yes. Okay. Clearly the trunk was full. It would have made more sense to put it somewhere else. Alright, we're off. Fuck this place. Fucking creepy ass motherfuckers. This is like the town where Texas Chainsaw happened. Okay. Being on the road, you do realize a thing. Monsters truly do exist. Yeah, I've never thought that on the road. And every single one of them looks just like you and me. Oh, yeah, actually, I understand that. True, true. People are fucked up. True. Mom, I swear to God. I swear to God. Can I turn the fucking radio on? Yes. It's not expired or anything, right? Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Let me check. God damn it. God damn it. Is this shit expired? I need a light. 
Fuck me. I can't tell. There's nothing. It doesn't say anything. It says new. Okay, let's move. Ugh. All right, let's keep going. Oh, I love this song. Oh, the fuck? Uh-oh. The lights. Don't tell me the battery's dying. Shit. Oh, they're bad. Piece of shit car. Literally driven less than a mile and there's been 50 events that happened. Is that a car in front of me? Oh, it is. Okay, well that means this guy's headed to the bridge as well. Uh, my shit's flickering. Oh my god, and then my lights go out. He's probably like, who, who the hell is this guy? Shit. He just sped off. Yeah, I should really stop. I, this is this is dangerous. I need to like how did this even happen to the car? I'm about to go back to the gas station. Someone behind me? Oh. 10 hour drive and a faulty battery. Oh, I love this song. It's fucking Little Pimp. Featuring little tea bag. I love this song. Yes. I'm telling you, man, little tea bag, he's gonna be big. Oh, shit! Oh, my God, this is the bridge. Okay, okay, hold on. This is the bridge the guy was talking about. A lot of people go missing here. I mean, how? It's just a bridge. I'm just gonna fucking gas through this shit and not stop. I have no reason to stop. All right, that was pretty straightforward. Okay. What did the guy say? A girl in white? And then he said, don't pick up anybody. Oh my god. This is so dangerous, driving with these lights flickering. It ain't good. Oh shit, there's a fucking car right here. There's like an abandoned car. Look at the back seat of your car. I can't. I can only look at the front. And a bunny just passed. All right, all right. Okay. Wait, there's a second bridge? Wait, no, this isn't a bridge. Can I actually stop and look at stuff? I don't know if I should be... There's this very weird thing about that night. I saw two big logs in the middle of the road blocking the way ahead. Uh, dude. Shit. I didn't think much of it at the time. I have an idea. I have an idea here. Okay. Wait, this whole thing is fenced. But not the left side. Dan always said, think outside the bo- Oh, fuck. Okay, we can't go around. Oh, shit. That's not in the script. 
Alright. Turn, lady! This car fucking sucks at turning! Yeah, maybe I should go to that left turn. I don't think I can move these logs. I'm not strong enough. Yay. I would turn around at this point and go back on the highway. Alright, let's fucking reverse. And there was a turn. Before I before I make that move, let me just see if I can do something. It's almost seemed as if someone had deliberately, but I didn't think much of it <coughs> at the time. Bro, there's no way I can move these. Those were heavy. Oh shit, I'm strong. Look at that, one hand each. Owned. What the fuck? Oh. Alright, good thing I took that fucking protein drink. Almost. Come on, come on. Perfect. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck was that? Must have been a bunny. All right. Yeah, it definitely looks like a creepy ass night. All right, and we're off. No way. No way, bro. This car's a piece of shit. Don't do this to me. The car wouldn't start back up. Bro! No, dude. I don't know any of this. And just like that, I was stranded in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. Come on, man. I'm not saying that I was starting to believe whatever the bullcrap that gas station clerk pulled. But I wouldn't, I would be lying if I say I didn't feel slightest of unease. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but throughout my life I was told not to take rides from strangers. Oh shit. Who the fuck's coming down this road? But the, at the moment I had no choice. I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. What happened? 10.23 p.m. Wait, what time was it initially? I saw a car nearing. <gasps> Help! Right here! Jesus! Crazy motherfucker! Pure evil. Shit! I didn't understand how somebody could leave another human being stranded like that. Should have taken the flight. I should have moved the logs back, lol. 10.43. Why didn't I move the logs back and be like, I need help? It's been 20 minutes. It's cold as fuck. This is the fucking setting of Hills Have Eyes. Oh, I'm gonna die here. Fuck me. Oh my god. Please. 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 Help me. Bam. Stop the car. Jesus. Oh, wait. Isn't that the guy from the gas station? You're the girl from the gas station. Thank you so much for stopping. What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. I can't call for help. There's no phone service. You think I can get a ride? Where are you headed to? Uh, nearest stop where I can call for help? Hop in. Thanks so much. Could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. Oh, this is a bad idea. 
Oh no, no, no. Oh fuck. Don't forget the dog food. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh fuck, oh fuck. All right, hold on. All right, all right. Let's see here. Yes, yes. Fuck me, the skateboard as well. All right. Hey, yo, don't drive off, man. I'm almost good. Last thing. Yeah, fuck the skateboard. All right. Bye, car, I guess. Bye. Piece of shit. Oh, yeah, what about the purse? I need the purse. I need the goddamn... Oh, wait, I already have it on me. Okay. All right. Yeah, the car's fucked anyways. Gotta call it AAA or something. This is Alabama, man. We don't have AAA. All right. I'm ready. What have I missed? Hurry up, I need to get moving now, I'm done. Finally, now hop in to be quick. All right. Here we go. Oh my God, thank you, man. I hope you're a father or something and not some fucking weird, creepy fuck. All right. <clears throat> so you won't tell me who you are, where you are going. I was driving home and that piece of crap broke down on me. What? My name's Jason. It's nice to meet you, Jason. All right, all right. We're just chilling, okay, bro? Jason, you're really lucky I had to be on this side of the town tonight. I must say you are one brave young woman. How's that? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? I think it was the battery. Are you sure? It's my dad's. It's pretty old. Oh, fuck. Never trust a Jason. So what did... What do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? Uh, <clears throat> I didn't listen to, uh, to a single word. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. So is it true? What, the monster? Let's see, I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are. There are some things. And I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them and you don't be bothered. Okay, sure, true, true. So why is this guy headed down this way? You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Uh, all good. All good. Alright, there's like literally nothing in this place. Ten minutes later. After a little bit of a small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Apparently they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are all kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. Okay, I survived. Where's all my shit? Oh. <laughs> nice. Uh, I'm fucking hungry again. Um, I had chips for dinner with a nice cola. Um, all right. Let's go with some fucking weird ass meat snacks. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh 
100% horse meat. Not approved for occupancy. What the fuck? The guy at the convenience store was wearing the same shirt. The man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Gal need a room to shack up for the night? Uh, yeah, I'm only gonna be here for a few hours. 40 for single. Pay cash only. Okay. Room number nine, right over there. All right, talk about the car. $90, Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Okay, fucking Tommy. All right. Good, I'll tell, I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. Uh-oh. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. I mean, shit. All right, room number nine. Is this your grandma or something? Oh my god, it's his wife. She seems nice. Hey, yo, what are you looking at on the computer, huh? What's on there, bro? What's on there? It's not even fucking plugged in. The monitor's not even plugged in. Okay, do they help? I don't think they help with, uh... My suitcase. All right, number nine. Number nine, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That must be nine right there. All right. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Dad, I might have to stay at a motel tonight. Hey, where are you at? Your dad's calling me. Holly, no service. Oh shit. It was nice and warm inside. Wait, what the fuck? The big ass fucking TV. Except there was a smell, but a type of musky smell you get from old houses. <laughs> fuck! Jesus Christ! Who the fuck are you? That was so random. What are you doing here? You scared the crap out of me. He he he. Who are you? I'm Tommy, your room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What were you doing in there? You know, cleaning stuff. Got the friend gave me this room. He he he. I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just get my stuff. Fucking bitch ass. Please wait outside. I said, go get your stuff. I am fucker. Piece of shit. Motherfucker, bitch ass. Fucking scaring the shit out of me. Well, at least I can get all my shit. I don't know, why is he cleaning at midnight? Really needed me some energy. Bro, I already fucking had a meat snack. Okay, okay. Guess I'll just leave him here. Can I use one of these trolleys for my luggage, man? The fuck? Okay, only a couple more. All right, let's take these. Why not hold the hat and the skateboard in one hand? Okay, just gonna, I'm just, I'm just saying. This hat doesn't weigh 50 tons. Okay. Or just wear the fucking hat. I should have left the hat in the trunk. All right, last two items. Dog food for the night. I'll watch some TV and eat the dog food. Okay. How do I know when this guy's done? Okay. We got our snackies. All right. Bro, what the fuck are you waiting for? Are you good? Bitch, had a word with Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. And also the room's phone is not working. If need anything, just ask at the front desk. 
We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. He he he. But you have a good night. Fucking creepy fuck. Motherfucker. Alright, I'm just gonna like throw my shit in here. Alright, maybe put this shit here. And grab this. And fucking lock the door. And fucking go to bed or something. I think- I think we gotta call it a day. At this point, it would make sense to, like, call your parents or something, you know? But apparently, there's still no service. Oh, I think he's going now. I think he just left. Alright. Fuck it, I'm going to sleep. Okay. Uh, call it a foresight, but there is something very off about that place. Gonna help shake the feeling that something wasn't right. I mean, what the fuck was in the bathroom? What the fuck was that noise? A hot cup of coffee could help, I thought to myself. Yeah, that's not what you want right now. But I guess we're gonna go outside. Yeah, it's like 3 a.m. This is not the time for a coffee. Where the fuck are you gonna get a hot cup of coffee? Wait, was there like a Keurig or some shit? Can I make coffee in the hotel room? No? Uh... Shit. We're not gonna get a hot coffee from the vending machine. Fuck. Hey, yo, man, I need coffee, bro. You got a coffee maker? You have a great night's sleep. What the fuck? Today I completed my first PC build. With that, I have entered the PC realms, but wouldn't feel right without your blessing. So please, Father Lyric, bless me as I begin this journey. Yo, man, that's exciting, dude. Have fun with it, bro. That's awesome. It's a new life, man. You're gonna be like, wait, there's another vending machine there. You might end up succumbing to just playing one game forever. Oh yeah, this is it. $2,000 gaming PC only plays League. But that's fine, no one's judging. I'll take a cappuccino. I'll fuck with the cappuccino! First thing you gotta do is download Counter-Strike. Did she just pass out from the cappuccino? What the fuck was in that? Fucking cappuccino. No one feels this way drinking a cup of coffee. Ah! Ah! Shit! I'm laying down. A coffee with a hint of LSD. Three eighteen. I was sedated. messed up, man. I thought the phone didn't work. Bro, there's clearly someone who just walked into the closet. That was the ending.
Auto saved. Wait, what? Get the fuck out of here, man. That was so dumb. Multiple endings? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Maybe we can do this a little fast. Episodes? Yeah, but there was no, like, concluded... It was just like... That was such a weird ending. Like, super weird. I'm just gonna buy this to consume it for the speed boost real quick. Yeah, that was like an ending where loud equals scary. There was no price on the cappuccino, by the way. Oh, that explains a lot. Alright, get ready, jump scare. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Creepy fucking hee hee, bitch. Okay. Ending one dies from a heart attack. All right, we need to go get the luggage now. Fuck me. That was the worst autosave. It's like three objectives behind. All right, all right, here we go. Yeah, I guess instead walk outside and avoid the closet instead. Yeah, she received messages, but she couldn't send any. Receiving one would be an indication to send one. Open the closet now. Yeah, I'll take a, ca a coffee instead of the cappuccino. Maybe drinking the cappuccino is a bad idea. Wait, what the fuck? I don't worry what job about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, 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 but don't you hear it? And also, front desk, leave it. But you have a good night. Okay. Wait, so what if I don't put all my stuff in here and just go to bed? Okay. All is good. Okay, I have to. I mean, I gotta go this way anyways. Yeah, I'm gonna turn the T- I'm gonna try turning the TV on. Where does this guy end up going? Is he going right into his truck? Yes. Holy shit. It must have been already running. Crazy ass EVs nowadays. You can't tell if they're on or off. Okay, so now we're gonna get into the coffee situation. Hide in the closet. All right, we had the creepy dude. There's something off with this place. Can I manual save? Uh-uh. Fuck it, I'll just watch this until daylight. Whatever. Da oh, okay, actually, <clears throat> coffee and late night cartoons. Fuck it. Might as well. I'm down, brother, I'm down, brother. Espresso, cappuccino, French vanilla. Okay, so there's only an espresso and a cappuccino, so it's one or the other. No straight up coffee. Oh my god, there wasn't fucking LSD in that. Uh oh, there was. 
Shit. Go to the front desk. This seems like a bad idea. Manager! Ah! The key Waza is inverted right now. Rah! He's not there. Motherfucker went to bed! Peepo trip. What is a cola gonna do? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. All right, all right. All right, we're back to the spot. I can't save manually. This game is potato. This is this game is like a indie game with a bit of potato in it. I was sedated. You're doing the same thing. I'm not going to open the closet. I'm gonna get up and leave. Fucking motherfucker. Didn't feel safe going out. Bro, you just saw someone go in there. Asshole! See the crouch? Uh, and then I can just go back to bed. Hey, what if I go to the bathroom? Someone just knock on the door? Hello? Oh, it's like the manager or something. Who is it? Joe from front desk, open the door! Hey, yo, what up, dude? Didn't I specifically tell you to not wake anyone up? What? I have complaints. What are you making all those goofy noises for? Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Is that why your eyes all red? Mention the copy machine. What the fuck you put in the copy? Are you messing with me? We don't have no copy machine here. It's right over there. Okay, okay, here. I've had enough of your crazy goons here for once. I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. I hate my job. Okay. Joe, there's someone in the closet, you bitch. Fucking asshole. Motherfucker's goddamn closet is filled with fucking Steve from Blue's Clues' wardrobe. Piece of shit. Wait, there's no coffee machine. Fuck. Yo, wait, wait, the closet. The closet, Joe. What what the hell? There was definitely a machine here. What happened? Show me your copy machine now! Fuck me! I don't know where it went. Fuck! I thought it was here! Where is it now? I don't fucking know. Where do you want me to go? Go back to the room. I swear to god I was right there. I said go back now! Okay. Did you not hear me? I said, go back to the room. I don't get out. There should be some medication in your room that should offer you some relief. Check the table by the TV. Let me guess. What is it? Oh, you want me to fucking consume something else now? There's still the guy in the closet situation. is that that's not a good idea that look like re requires water was there water could i have bought water 
Wait a minute. Okay. Or I could just use the faucet. I thought I maybe had to go and get like a water bottle. Okay, let's take these random pills that look like a prescription bottle in a random ass motel. Great idea. I mean, I do feel better though. All right, let's let's go back to bed. This is like the longest fucking night. Uh, maybe I gotta shut the TV off or something. Oh, I love this part. Oh yeah. Best part in the whole show. I don't get it. Whoa, what the fuck? Did someone just take a picture? Oh wait, no, no, no. Oh God. Oh shit. How is, this is the weirdest bathroom. All right, I don't need to take a shit. Okay. What if I try to go to bed now? Hello? <gasps> what the fuck? Hello? Who the fuck is saying hello? Oh, hello? no. Uh, who is it? Please open the door. I need help. What do you want? I need your help. Please, please open the door. N uh, no. I know you are in there. Fuck you, bitch. Back the fuck up. I'll throw the fucking TV at you. Please leave. I just need to talk to you. I swear I'm not a cop. Please go away. I'm gonna call the cops. Pretty lady, come on. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Joe? Joe? Fuck the closet! Is that an. To this day, I find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year. I never went on long road trips again. I would always take airplanes. Whoa. Fucking Joe, bruh! <coughs> what the fuck? We got the true ending. Wow, man! Just like that. Interesting. Okay, okay, I mean shit, dude. You know what I'm saying? I mean a shit, dude.
Okay. TLDR, you know, there's some creepy motherfuckers out there. Especially when you're a girl by yourself. Some fucking weirdos. I think the first episode was better. I would say the first episode was better. But, uh, yeah, man. Hmm. Hmm. That was, hey, the first episode was was a bit more, but I, I see. So was the copy machine haunted? Yeah, wait, so what the fuck? What, what happened? Did she actually drink the coffee then? And then the coffee machine wasn't there? The fuck? The coffee machine was fake. I guess so.